Like seriously though, Bordeaux is just such a lovely city to uh, to be in. We we're just around the corner from the street, and uh, it's kind of the road that leads down to the opera and the the main place. And yeah, we just feel so privileged. And I mean, look at this architecture. I'm sorry it's so bumpy. It's because I'm pushing the pram at the same time, but. Yeah, it's just, it's beautiful and we're very grateful. And we made it. This is our gym, an orange bleu. Our local monopoly, still open. Okay, so that was interesting. I came to buy um, some meat for a roast tonight and the butcher section of monopoly was closed already. So I've gotten a roast, well, I've gotten it a duck portion. I'm gonna to have to give it a go at searing it and roasting it myself. So this could be interesting, but fingers crossed, you know, we'll be truly French if we can manage to cook duck. I got any photos of it yet, but I haven't filmed it. The doodle man, as we call him. We learnt in our guide of the city that um, the doodle man, as we call him, is um, a temporary exhibition by a British artist um, and there's 22 of them around the city. So yeah, they're always surprised. You're like, oh, there's a doodle man if you happen to come upon one. But yes, they are essentially a large, I don't know what it's made of, steel structure. Not steel, because rusted steel. Um, of a man with his appendage out. So yes, got to love a bit of culture, even though this one is English culture, not French culture. But the French adopted it. All right, we made it home. Guess who's walking up the stairs? Hey, I wonder where, oh yes. We tore the suit, but I still love it, so I still get to wear it. Hey, hey, can you go find daddy? Up, up, up the stairs we go. Oh. Yes, you monster monkey. Hey. Yeah. Oh, one more. Yeah. yeah, you did it. Hey, where's daddy? Where's daddy? You passed out in his underwear somewhere? Oh dear. Oh dear. We've got a bit of a dead daddy. I'm a dead daddy. You've got a dead it daddy. It is so hot. It is very hot. It was just all sun. It's all sun. It's very muggy. It's mm. hugely muggy. Yes, what are you going to be up to? Oh dear. All right, so we cooled down from our morning walk in Little Miss is having some tomato and cucumbers. Daddy, we just finished the call with the grandparents. Daddy is making the lunch. Beep. After cooling down himself, he was very, very hot from his run. And yes, we're all going to sit down and have a lovely lunch, hopefully. And then, fingers crossed, you'll want a nap again. Although you slept so late, you might not want it. But you're going to be put down regardless. Yeah. All right, so I forgot to mention it before, but um, Little Miss is asleep and what we usually do in the afternoons, um, we'll do some, some study, um, some study while she's asleep and Adam does some work as well. So yeah, um, that's what's happening today. There's a ripper storm outside. It's kind of dying down a little bit now, um, but yeah, some good thunder and lightning, which is always good it always makes you feel very secure about being inside a house I find but yes that's what we're doing this afternoon look who woke up hey and now you're busy at work aren't you yes all this busyness so productive or do you want to get down now yeah yeah you want to get down okay one second hey suitcases provide the wealth of entertainment, don't they, Amelia? Hey, my daddy plays a very important game. <laughs> this is our favourite. Hey, how about you put that back? 
You gonna put it back? I need to turn the light on so we can see you. Oh, even then it's still pretty dark. Oh, you're grabbing another one. You're not in fact putting it back. <laughs> you're cheeky. Yeah, where are you going? We're going to London tomorrow. Not quite tomorrow. Not tomorrow. We're packing tomorrow though. We'll need the suitcases tomorrow. Yeah. And she's off again. Oh, back again. May I have a kiss? All right, dinner tonight, I'm just banging up some roast veggies. I'm gonna stick them in the oven now and hopefully in an hour they'll be ready. And an hour later, don't look too shabby and neither does the duck. So finger crossed, it'll all be okay. So final product, not too shabby. I'll show you Adam's plate because it's still untouched. Not too shabby, I don't think. The plates are huge, so they they um, make it look kind of small, but it is quite a lot. Okay, and Amelia's starting on some tomatoes, and then she'll have a little duck later with some rice, hopefully. But yeah, not too shabby. Didn't fancy the duck so much, did you? It's lying rejected over here. Oh, oh. Hey, but you do love your rice, don't you? And mummy does too. This is just instant rice. It's so handy and Amelia loves it. Yeah. But yes, mummy had an extra dose of roasted veggies because I'm rather addicted. And that's the whole point of doing roasted veggies because you can have like mm. lots and it's delicious. Hey guys, I just realized I completely forgot to sign up for today. Um, so I'll say goodnight. It's now 19 past midnight. I've just been doing job applications as he's been working and we're about to hit the hay and fingers crossed she gives us a little bit more of a sleep in like, um, like yesterday. Although I don't think I'll let her sleep until 9.30 again. <laughs> yeah. Um, so yeah, thanks so much for watching and we'll catch you in the next one. Cheers.